Hello, Aternum, and welcome to KOTT News, Aternum's number one source for news. And this is the War Report. Dynamic change in the history of Aternum last night as the marauders of HBM claimed the high ground of the mud hill, conquering the restless shore. HBM leadership unavailable for comment on the matter as their forces immediately move to reinforce their hold on the eastern coast. The fighting continues tonight with three more submissions for simulated fantasy combat resolution. Brought to you by LARPCO. Remember, if it isn't LARPCO, it's cardboard. Tonight, the Covenant Converts of Hold W attack the Marauders of HBM for control of the rain-drenched mountain region of Morningdale. Hold W seen preparing to proselytize to the citizens of Greyvale, offering them the comfort of the spark and relief from the marauders. HBM forces are already double-timing it back to the fort down by the river, making a rapid turnaround on short rest to prevent the conversion. Meanwhile, the Covenant hero worshippers of Outcasts assault the marauders of Big Pharma, for control of the free-range tiger sanctuaries of Evanscale Reach. Outcasts declare their right to rematch and march their armies to the bamboo preserves in order to lay siege to the castle nestled within. Big Pharma, divided in their attention tonight, will have to delegate their forces among this defense and their own plans for expansion also. Elsewhere, the marauders of Big Pharma assail the syndicate members of Fresh Bench for control of the island's primary oil reserves of Weaver's Fen. In their offensive effort of the evening, Big Pharma returned to the Peat Moss Bog in their attempt to claim the high ground in time for a spring hunting season. But Fresh Bench have been fending off more and more armies as they continue to improve in their ability to stand against groups of loosely organized militias. We'll have any late-breaking outcomes and reactions from the citizens tonight at 11. Until then, this has been War Correspondent John Chalant, KOTT News.